Central PA has certainly seen its share of great professional athletes, from Jack Ham to Larry Johnson and even Eric Milton. And it appears that we may be ready to add another name to the list. Phillipsburg's Matt Adams is beginning his second full season with the St. Louis Cardinals. We caught up with him at Victory Sports Performance in State College, where he reflected on 2013 and his call to the bigs. I got yanked out of my AAA game out in Las Vegas. Uh, I think I was in the it was in the fourth inning or something, and I just scored. And the guy got thrown out second. And I, I was running out to, to do the warmups, and in between innings, and my coach was screaming my name. So I, I thought I did something wrong, but. As soon as I, I knew what was going on, I, I either figured I got traded or I got the call I was waiting for and went in and he gave me a hug and told me I was going to the big leagues. So it was being able to go into the clubhouse and make that call to my mom and dad and it was, it was very special. 2013 was Adam's first full season in the majors and he didn't disappoint, hitting 285 with 17 homers and 51 RBIs. I felt good coming out of spring training, but but I knew I was going to get a li limited number of bats, you know, with with Allen at first and, and you know our, our stud outfield that we have. But um, I, I was prepared, ready to to go whenever my name was called. And you know, at, at, at first it was about every third or fourth game I was getting getting a start and getting some pinch hits in in between that. But um, then when Allen went down, you know, I was I was able to play every day, and and I knew that. Um, it was a shame that Allen got hurt, but I knew that I had to run with that opportunity and show him that I could play every day. Adams helped lead the Cardinals all the way to the World Series and talked about the postseason run. Yeah, the, the biggest thing was, was just making that last out in the regular season, knowing that we clinched the this NL Central and we, we had a playoff spot. So um, celebrating that was, was pretty cool, but then going in and celebrating the DS and the, the CS and, and the clubhouse with the guys knowing that we were Go in the World Series to play a, another class act or organization with the Boston Red Sox. It was, it was pretty cool, you know, and, and for, for me to be blessed enough to, to be part of that my first year is, is very special. The Cardinals are counting on Adams to be their everyday first baseman, and according to his trainer, Rob Oshinsky, he's had a great offseason. He's poured himself in every offseason, but this year he was hungry at a whole new level. I mean, for people who are Rocky fans, I mean, it was it was eye of the tiger time for him. I mean, he went. He went back to the core of, of his roots and where his dream really was. He worked harder this year than any other year. This is Adam's third offseason at Victory, and he credits Oshinsky's training with much of his success. He trains you sports specific. You know, he, he trains a baseball player like a baseball player. He trains a football player like a football player needs to be trained at. You know, he's, he's the best at what he does. You know, he, he's very, very smart and, and knows the body inside and out. So he knows what exercises a, a baseball player needs to do and and how hard to push them. And Oshinsky believes Cardinal fans will see a completely different player in 2014. I think the thing that people are going to be surprised about this year is Matt's increase in speed. You know, we grew up with, with people telling us that you're as fast as you're going to be when you're in high school. I'm telling you, people that watched Matt Adams last year are going to see a different athlete on the field this year. While Adams will be lighting it up in the majors this season, he still loves coming home even if he was blown away by the celebration in his hometown of Phillipsburg following the World Series. It was special, a little overwhelming though. You know, I'm, I'm a guy that just likes to, to get his work in and then be kind of on his own, you know. Um, spend time with friends, spend time with family, but, but this year has definitely been different. People showing up at the house, people calling day in and day out wanting something signed, you know, so it's, it's been a little, a little busy, a little hectic at times, but you know, I, I'll always come back here. You know, this, this is home for me. And it's great to see Matt living out his dreams in the major leagues, and we wish him the best in 2014.